Hey everybody, it's Saint Mighty Eyes. Welcome to So You Wanna Play? And today we're back playing Warzone and we're gonna continue where we left off. If you've not seen previous episodes, the link will be in the description below. And today guys we'll be playing the next level, Beyond Blue. And last time guys, I played the level ham or turkey. It was a tough level, really. With the bonuses of the troops though, but they only spawn in the region they are in. So that was a hard level to learn though, and I didn't get to start out, but I did an off-screen recording of the level, and I got a star in 15 turns. So here's the footage how I got the star, turn by turn. I use the same strategy in a different approach where I have my commander as the battering ram literally going in and trying to meet up with the other commander. But as I was doing that though, I was building up my forces with my troops and basically the new ones that spawn every turn join up with other regions and then forming bigger forces and then backing up the main forces that were trying to do some damage or attack other commanders. But it worked well and, and it takes at least 15 turns like from the start where I'm at and to get to the last commander on the very on the very left of the map. So it helped me and it was able to work. So that was my strategy. But if you have any, your own strategy, comment down below and let me know what you think. So with that being said, I hope you enjoy for today's vid. So let's play the level Feeling Blue. Well, loading was much faster than it was. Uh, but the reason why, because they got a new computer, so you might think so will a lot move faster. Anyway, this is a nice globe map. In this level, you use the one army must stand guard setting, which requires that you leave one army behind on every territory you own. Hmm. So it's kind of like a risk. We're battling against free AI armies. So, let's check the settings. One army must stand guard. So basically, you have to have at least one troop behind instead of zero. And it makes it a little harder though because of the way how we attack now. Oshinaka, that's the map, and we're we're started in pre placed territory. And for those who don't know reinforcement cards, get a hold card, you get additional amount of troops. Just say so you all know. Alright. So, with that being said, Let's do this. This is a nice map right here because, like, uh, got all these territories right here. Like, look at the amount of troops we can get if we conquer all of Australia. Indonesia, right here, and I think this is Northern Asia. This is like Japan. And down here, on our end, it's New Zealand. So we're basically got. 
we're fighting for the continent of Australia and uh, some islands off of Asia. Okay. And what to do first? This territory will get five, but this one will get three. I think for stars we should... Uh, Now we, we can attack with 7, but we're actually attacking with 6, so with one troop though, must be left behind, so we have to keep that in mind, how we're going to approach this map. This will, I'll try to figure out a stride for this area right here, alright? That being said, let's commit. It takes five pieces for a reinforcement card if you get a, a territory that is. And we'll get like additional five troops, so let's keep that in mind. Okay, if we were attacking with just free though, it wouldn't be enough though, because it was just one to defeat that territory. So Let's at each of our territories must have at least four this time, rather than three. Okay. Right. Let's get, get let's capture the rest of New Zealand. This will just uh, we're saving up the troops so it, it'll be ready. All right, let's commit. We're up to eight fort armies now. Put us up to seven. Give that four. I'll attack with at least five. Alright. That's what we'll do for now. Let's commit. And if we capture this area, the island of Tasmania. I guess that's where the Tasmanian devil is. Whoops. Alright. Let's we'll get additional troop. Alright, let's commit. Okay, we got up to nine armies now. Hey, okay, we'll start uh, attacking this territory right here. All right, let's commit. Oh, we made contact with the green army. Okay, I think I'll put one troop right here. And now let me clarify about the troop troops. So, if we only have three, it won't be enough to capture our territory on its own. So it must be at least four or better. All right. And for this move, though, I'll just uh, focus on capturing this territory right here, getting the rest of the, and get the five troops right there. And for this one, though. I'll have to figure out what to do against the Green Army. May I want to attack with this first. And this one will join up and help it out. This will just bear and wait, I guess. Okay, let's commit. Ooh, he got five right there. That's not good. That's not going to be good. Oh, actually, he's turning away. Okay, that helped us. And also, we got a reinforcement card, so let's use that. That's what we'll do for now. Like I said, I have no clue what the Green Army is going to do against me. So let's well, so let's see. Let's commit. He's going a narrow way. Oh, we made contact with the. What are we saying? Like, I can't even tell. Probably it's a red, reddish color. Okay. 
So these forces can't do anything right here. But uh, in the meantime, I could kept this territory right here and get additional amounts of troops. Can't tell. <laughs> Anyone remember that reference? Or we'll call that reference of the name? Hey. Oh, I've got this territory right here. I think I'll put this up top with this one. Alright, so what we'll do for now, let's commit. Ah, oh, crud. The guy's really pulling the hammer on me. Okay, we're up to 21 armies, so we could do two two things. Hopefully, capture the rest of this territory to help the the forces. But down here, it's going to have a struggle. So is this one up top? Oh, wait, that's what I was trying to do. Capture that territory. Alright, my mistake. Man, I'll just uh, focus on just getting the rest of this uh, territory up top. This one, they can't do anything. Alright, let's see how this move comes out though. I can't do anything, but if I do, I'll get more troops support right here. Get like five. That will help us big time. But up here, they're just going to have to defend this area. Okay, right. let's commit. Oh crud, he put eight right there. That's not gonna do me any good. Alright, he's moving backwards. Alright. I could get this territory here to just give us more troop support. But here I'm just trying to delay the inevitable on the enemy. Maybe well, I'll do this though. Just if he captures all the rest of this area, I'll cut his troop support in half. And this will tackle us. Alright. I think that's all we can do for now. In this territory, it can't do anything. Alright, let's commit. Okay, he's moving back. Contact with the pink army right there. Crud. Okay, we we're up to free free troops, so that's good. I think we're starting to have to start pushing his forces back in. Pink Army, I don't know how much firepower he has. Still though, we gotta make some ground. This one probably attack lost. Okay, 
So far, so good. Let's commit. Damn, he, that guy got like five forces right there. Well, at least we'll get six armies right here. The pink armies coming up top. Oh, crap, he defend that area. He knew I was going to do that. Oh, here comes the pink army. This time, pal. Okay, good turn, and we get reinforcement cards, so let's use that. Now I'm dealing with the pink army right here. So uh, let me figure this out real carefully. Okay, basically I'll have to make a damage right here, make a jump on the enemy. It only depends on like, who flinches first. Okay, let's see how this all plays out right here. Like I said, I'm just trying to attack in Australia. Alright, let's see how this move turns out. Let's commit. Oh, the dude went big right there. So that guy right there. All it depends on who flinches first. That guy did. But won't be able to win that battle right there. He put a nice pair of pink armies for coming right at me head on. And the brown armies turning around. Where do you come from? That's not going to do me any good. Denied right there. Okay, we're up to gain some troops. We're up to 46 now. The pink army right here is giving me problems now. I can't do anything with this territory right here. This one I'll have to go up top, beat that green army right there. Alright, let's see how this move plays out right here. I, there's nothing I can do about the this army right here. Because he'll slam me unless he's trying to separate and get more territory up here and here. Alright, that's all we can do now. That's everything, and that's everybody. Let's commit. Why? Just why? And this guy, why?
That guy denied me. Crud. There goes my bonus. At least I was able to scare that guy off. Well, if he doesn't get a bonus, if I don't get a, lose a bonus, he loses a bonus. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Why? Just why? Oh. Welcome to rest, folks. Well, this is a war zone. Great, now I have to fight from this territory back. Okay, we took a huge blow right here and here, so I have to fight for a ba fight back for it. Okay, I'll try to capture my territory right here. I can't find them off head on. Well, that, maybe I could try to capture this territory right here. This give me more troops. Attack last. These will defend. These will attack there. Okay. Mediocre strategy, but try and make some ground somewhere. All right, let's commit. Why? Just why? What have I done to you? And the same as that guy. Well, at least take his anger off the air, off of me for now. Ah, oh, crap. Right now, I got to fight for that territory back. Goodness, I'll get these horse right over here. I'm having a losing bell right here in the in this area. Alright, at least I'll get some troops back. Okay, that was somewhat of a turn right there. I haven't got one territory back, but not this one. And then this one I haven't totally completed. Alright. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. 
try to capture the rest of this territory right here, just for the benefit. This one I have no clue, but maybe I could scare the pink army. Let me just think, I gotta make a dent on this guy. Get, let him lose some troops though. If I do that though, he'll, he'll lose some ground. Double check this everyone. Okay. Let's commit. I knew I was going to do something stupid. Really? Why are you getting all these troops? He's probably captured all of all this island right here. That's how I picture it. Still haven't got that territory back. Why? Guess why? And I lose some troops right there. Really? Where are you getting these troops, pal? Alright, at least I'm getting my... Never mind. Crud. Alright, at least I get that bit back. No good right there. Okay, I'm up to 61. This I can't do anything about because he's really going to pulverize me. Crowd that force is going to have problems. Alright, there's something more I can do here. Like I said, I have no clue who got that 10 armor though. Probably he's getting it from over here. Only well, he doesn't get the bonus right there because I'm right, right here. He's getting probably getting from all these other territories. So I have to prevent it from him. Alright. I think there's something else. Alright, let's commit. Hopefully we'll go. Oh. Got to do something right there. Yeah. Alright, let's commit. Damn, that guy's that guy's not giving up. So it all depends on who flinched first. Seriously, man. Alright, at least I'll get that territory back. Uh oh. It's not good. Oh, damper is him because he won't get that amount of troops. Yeah. 
we'll get that bonus. Why? Just why? What have I done to you? Alright, we got reinforcement cards, so let's see it. use that. Hopefully it will help us tremendously. Say for example like this force right here is about to clobber me. Okay. So basically I'm trying to capture the rest of this territory and push the pink army back. He's already got me beat with all this big force right there. But if I can take him from over top, maybe that'll help us. Okay, I think that's everyone. So far we can make some damage. Let's commit. That pink army is not giving up. Now it's the brown army. Well, it depends on who plunged first. Like he did. Probably scare him back. There goes the brown army. Good. Bad move, man. Taking his anger on me and I'm making him pay for it. Green always trying to hang on for dear life. Needs to make a at least I finally broke for the guy. Okay, now we got 85 forces. Let's utilize them. So I got plenty of truth right here. That will help us tremendously. Well, why don't I say it twice, but see what more we could uh, do. Okay, here's what I'll have to do first. Like I said, I'll have to support each of my troops. Make sure I get back up. Plenty of backup. Alright, that's what we'll do for now. I think the green armor is fine for his life. Alright, let's commit. Whoop, I called it. And the pink armor is not budging.
There goes the green army. Now we're moving. There goes the green army. Now we're up to 102 troops. Now we can really do some damage. Okay. I'm gonna try to try to capture all the rest of the air. And I think in this move, I think we'll get the rest of Australia. Get that big bonus right there. Hopefully this works right here. Well, our main focus is on the pink army now. Okay. So let's move to the out first, let's commit. That guy's not gonna budge. He's really not gonna budge. So much for that. All of Australia is almost ours. Except for that bit. Okay, we have 122 forces. Hmm, I wonder what we're gonna do. The rest of the forces that we're gonna have to push off of that area. Okay, all I gotta do is just attack these territories and move in. That's all I gotta do. There's we basically got the game in the back at this point. I know it's a little bit of an overkill, but hey. But we're this map's just about over, I think, in like let's see, one. Left just turn one. Two, two free more turns. Like I said, I have no turn, no clue what's the turn of the of the Gang of Star. All right, let's commit. That guy really want he doesn't want Australia to go. Julie pal, this territory is mine.
I got Australia now. Took a lot, but we finally got it. Alright. Two more turns. That stinks. Alright, there's nothing more I can do in this area. It's basically this game's just about done. Okay, let's commit. We got a reinforcement card. But, like I said, when you conquer Australia, you basically got the game done. Really? Okay, one more turn. Alright, nothing else to do here. Alright, let's commit. I don't think I got the star for this level. If I did, huh. <laughs> Well, only the last turn. About damn time. Alright. We won. No brainer. Alright. Last time, let's commit. Yep. Yeah, there was no chance you were going to survive that, pal. Alright. Finally. Game set match. Oh, we got the star! <laughs> Alright, the anticipation, but... Alright, guys, we got the star. I like... Wow, I thought I went over, but I guess not. Um, I think it's around like turn 17 and turn 16, 17, and 18. I was starting to pull away, and then I made up with the with the level. All right. Now before I uh, move on, let's check the history. Okay. That army spawned there. Where did the green army? Oh, the green army was up top. Okay. Let me zoom in like this. Yeah, I'll give a bit of review. Yeah, the green army was falling in Japan, the uh, pink army was forming up off of Asia, the brown army was in Australia. So fortunately though, guys, we uh, got the star off of this one, knock on wood. The only question is, what was the turn limit though? Around here, the pink army was starting to get more territory because he already conquered all of Indonesia. Did he? Well, almost all of Indonesia. Yeah, the green army was fine for his life. But he didn't want down first, except for the brown army. After that, we clean house with the, yes, the pink army. Yeah, once we capture Australia, the game was already over. Yep. Okay, guys. So we fought. That's that's how it went. So let me share this for fast. Okay, guys. So that was feeling blue. Now I had some level attempts at doing this level, and I couldn't even figure it out. Though it was tricky to. It's not like Warzone where you have to leave with zero forces, but you have to leave at least one troop behind, like Risk. Hey, well, I was able to come up with strategy and walk away with that. Now the big question is, what was the turn limit of getting us of feeling blue for the star? 
exactly 22 turns. Okay. So, we were lucky to walk away with a star, guys. But, hey, I feel like I could do better. Like I said, I'll do a try doing off-screen recording of Feeling Blue in a future days. But, I'll do, like I said, I'm doing a... See if I could do A in my old level. See if I can do in lesser turns. So, like a personal best, though. Okay. Next time, guys, we'll be playing the next level. Stuck together. Hmm. That's going to be interesting. So as always, like the video, comment down below what you think the video and the series thus far, share, spread a word about me, and if you want to know the next content, why not subscribe and join the Maddie Gang now? So are you in? Also hit that notification bell to get word of the next upload. So GG guys, thank you for taking your time of watching my vid today. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your day. TFW, thanks for watching. Goodbye everybody.